What's up YouTube? Today it's MB Frondorf and today I'm going to be showing you how to restore your iPod after it's been disabled for an extensive amount of time and you've forgotten your password. Just know that all the data on this device will be removed and it cannot be restored unless it was previously backed up. Go ahead and open iTunes and then plug your device into the computer. It'll give you an error message like this, but don't worry, it's completely normal. The next step is to put your device into DFU mode. Do this by turning your device off, then holding the power button for 3 seconds, then the home and the power button for 10 seconds, and then just the home button for 15 seconds. If done so correctly, iTunes should give you a message that looks like this. Just go ahead and click on restore iPod and then follow the prompts and then it will start to restore your iPod. It does have to download the firmware first which can take a while. After the firmware is downloaded it will start to extract the software onto your device and start the restore process. On your device there will be a little loading Apple logo and it will look like this. After iTunes is done, it'll start to boot up, it'll have another loading bar, but it doesn't take nearly as long as the first one did, and it'll boot up so you can set it up like it was brand new. From there you can go through the setup process and go ahead and set up your freshly restored iPod. I hope this video helped you out, if you liked it, make sure you give it a thumbs up, and if you want to see more videos like this, be sure to subscribe.